everybody, this is Reese Barber from Audiology Associates. Thanks very much for watching that Earwax Removal compilation video today. Uh, now you can see it's first patient, very uh, humid, but also there's a lot of oil gone in here, which is what's smudging all over the, uh, the camera as we go in. So our very kind of soft, uh, squishy type earwax, but similar to what we had in a video, I think it was the beginning part of the week, we had a very squishy wax, uh, but this isn't quite as, as loosened up here. There's lots of hair embedded in here, little bits of uh, sort of moist, over moisturized skin, wax, it's all going on in this ear canal here. Uh, so we're just getting a good grip on this central plug we managed to clear some of the softer debris away. You can see even as we're pulling this down, bits are all getting sucked into the machine uh, as we're going along there. So we're just gonna work on this bigger, slightly harder plug uh, that's usually right in the core. If you get a lot of these squishy waxes, it's unusual for them to be really soft all the way through. They tend to have the front section is really soft and a central harder core there in the middle, which is what we're working on here. Little bit of a wiggle. Oh, you can see just how old some of that wax is. Very, very dark in color there. Let's give this a bit more of a wiggle out. There we go, out that comes. Bit of a tail attached to the end of that one. And it's just pushed through the cilia. Oh my goodness, there's more in there. So we need to get that out as well. You can see how these hairs have just permeated all the way through this wax. And this is from usually most of the time, I've got to be honest, some ear hair trims. Uh, so the, the, the hairs don't really have too far to go. So they end up getting stuck in the wax because that's the wax's job is to pick up all the dirt and debris from the ear canal and expel it from the ear. Unfortunately, it got a little bit stuck in this case. So it's all embedded inside the wax. You can see it's really, really thick with hair and that binds that wax together. It really kind of dries and forces around it like this. So the eardrum there, uh, oh, looking much better. Let's have a little look. There we go, there's the eardrum looking much better. Uh, so you can see a big difference in that particular ear canal. Now this uh, is the second ear here, or the other ear because you've only got two. Uh, you can see uh, very, very soft as well on this side. Let's give this a bit of a wiggle here at the entrance. Is that going to come away? You can see the canal entrance here is quite narrow. See, it's almost letterbox. Uh, you don't have letterboxes in the US. You have mailboxes near. Here. here in the UK, we have letterboxes, no doors. Now they look like this. Well, not too much like that, but it's the, you get the kind of general shape. We're kind of this more sort of oval, but very flattened and squished on its side oval. Uh, so you can see it's coming away really, really well. It's because it's nice and soft. Luckily here, we can just hold the suction tube at the entrance to the canal and bring the wax to us. So it's all working its way down the ear canal here until we get to this harder section. And we can give this a good, ah, just broke away. See, I, it's, I don't know the power of the wiggle sometimes, guys. It'll just shear the wax off. Uh, so we're just taking all this away. There we are. And oh, a much drier section behind here. Let's see if we can get a grip on that. Ooh, not easy because it's slightly angular, so not the greatest of suction grips. Is it going to get all the way through? There we go, out that comes. And oh my goodness, brought another piece with it as well. We're still going. This is the ear that just keeps giving, guys. This one, it's uh, it's going and going and going. You can see the wax getting gradually darker as well as we take it away, so a little bit more oxidized. Oh, look at that one. That is a good chunk to have down on top of your eardrum. Uh, so we've got to be a little bit careful here, very, very slow uh, down to this one. Let's get a grip. We're going to have to, you can't just sort of lift straight up. We're going to have to draw and bring it over the brow of that recess. There we go. Out there. Oh, got a bit stuck. Hang on. Look at the size of that. It actually got wedged in that particular part of the ear canal. That was a chunky bit of wax. Out that's going to come. There we go. Uh, let's take a look behind that. Eardrum looking lovely. Uh, so this is what it looked like before. And this is what it looks like after. So you can see a, a big difference there. So we've got three and a half centimeters, one and a half. Well, what do you got? What do the Americans say? One and a half, one and seven sixteenths, would you say there, guys? I'll let, that one, I'll let you debate that one in the comment section below. Uh, but it looks really, really conquer brown in color, really dark. Patient very, very relieved to get that out. Uh, now this one, you can see patients done a fab job of oiling this. There's so much oil in here. This should come out like a greased weasel, guys. It should shoot out the ear canal, this one, I think. So we're just gonna get a hold on this. How is this gonna come out? Oh, we've hit a bit of resistance. Oh, a little bit of dry skin there holding that in. You can see that layer of dry skin at the base. There you go, it just got sucked into the, the tube there. Out, this is gonna come, bit of a wiggle. There you go. 
Look at that. That came away really, wow, it's still there. Well, it's, it's quite a long piece, that one actually, a fair old chunky size piece. Um, there we are, eardrum looking good. There's an annoying little bit right at the end. Let's get rid of that first. A little bit of oil. Yep, let's get rid of that as well. There we go. Uh, and then, do you see there was one, there's always one bit just hiding around the corner somewhere. Look, let's grab that bit as well. Patient's actually talking to me at this point. Sometimes if you see, uh, the canal wall or you see the endoscope moving up and down it's because when we brace uh, and we bridge I bridge here uh, a lot of the time and obviously there and the other side so you'll you'll the jaw movement will actually make it move up and down sometimes so we have uh, oh gosh just over half an inch uh, <laughs> there, there just over half an inch six sixteenths is that a thing I don't think it's probably not a thing. Uh, and then you've got a centimeter and a half, that piece. Um, oh, what have we got here? This looks like a softer, squishier type wax. They can be deceptive though. When you get the sheen to them and they're a bit bobbly on the surface, they're either going to be really soft or they're going to be rock solid. So which is this going to be? Let's have a little look. Rock solid. Yeah, you can see it. You never know. When you take a look, you, you, until you get the suction tube on top, you kind of, you build up a sort of wax library, if you like, in your head of different uh, colors and textures and how they react when you suction them. And when you look at a piece of wax, you're always thinking, ah, oh, that's going to come out with blah, blah, blah. Uh, but you never know. It's not until you get the suction tube on it, you'll know. So nice big chunky piece there come away. Actually broke away from the second section. Now, is this going to come away? You can see how hard that is there. So obviously I'm suctioning and we've got to sort of bend it. We've got to turn it slightly to get out the ear canal here, which is what I'm doing with the suction tube. And a bit of a wiggle and a bit more of a wiggle and a bit more. There we are, out he comes. Yeah, you can see it's pretty, it's pretty solid in there. Um, let's take a look behind that. Oh, that ear drum looks lovely. So this is what it looked like beforehand. And this is what it looks like afterwards. You can see really, that is a textbook eardrum. That is shiny and pulescent. It's exactly the way an eardrum should look. Uh, so you can see now this uh, patient's other ear canal. We know from the first ear it was pretty solid. So let's, we're assuming it's gonna be the same on this side. There's a little bit of dry skin which is just holding the front end of this wax in. So I'm just lifting that front section and giving this a little bit of a, a wiggle, but it's, it's not really budging too well here. You can see it's not got a tremendous amount of movement. Oh, there we go. It's starting to come forward. This is gonna get stuck though. You can see it's really, it was edging its way forwards. And if you look very carefully, when I'm trying to get the suction grip, it's actually just dropping back. It's pulling forwards, then dropping back a little bit. So it's quite a mobile piece of wax here. So I've popped a lot of olive oil in. Uh, the reason being, if we can get it moving this time, I'm hoping that the olive oil is just gonna uh, sort of ease the exit from the ear canal. It's just gonna help it to move forwards a little bit. If not, we'll have to go in with a different tool, I think. Is it gonna go? I'm aiming the suction tube slightly differently here because the front end of the wax is sloped like this. So if you go in this way, you're not gonna get the suction grip. If you go in that way, you can get the suction grip on it. There we go. Oh, micro wiggles. Now that's a new one for you guys. You'll see as I'm bringing this out, I'm doing very, very quick and very, well, it's slowed down a little bit now, but very, very quick and short wiggle movements forwards. And that's what you're just kind of edging it out of the canal. So there it goes. Look how long that piece is. Wow, that is a good one. That is such a long piece of wax. Let's take a look behind that. Eardrum looking lovely, really, really healthy there. A little tiny bit of dry skin, so we're just gonna work my way around. There we are. See if we can get rid of that top section, and then we're gonna work down that section to the left hand side as well. I'd imagine. Yeah, there we go. Out that comes. Let's take that bit off there. Doesn't want to go. There we go. Now let's take a look behind there. Just make sure everything's okay. Yep, yeah, eardrum looks absolutely perfect. So this is what it looked like at the start. And this is what it looks like afterwards. You can see a very, very different ear canal. So that's the two pieces we took away. So we've got three and a half centimeters, uh, one and 
blah, blah, blah. Three sixteenths of an inch. Is, I, don't, oh, I meant to have a look to see if eight sixteenths was a thing, but eight sixteenths surely would be half an inch, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. I don't, ignore the eight sixteenths thing. I don't know where that came from. But you can see it's a it's a fair old sized piece of wax there, guys. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video as much as I did. I hope you're on a fab weekend. So this is Saturday's video after all. Um, so as always, guys, take care of yourselves, take care of your ears, and take care of one another. And I shall see you again next week. All the best, guys. Bye.